Welcome to the MBX Films Theater. I've got something a little different here today. I am going to quiz you. I'm going to show you some action figure accessories. No context. You just have to look at them, and you're going to guess which figure it's from. Uh, most of these items are going to be from late 80s uh, all throughout the 90s. So that's going to be the time frame of these accessories. So obviously not everybody knows and owned every figure in the world, so there's some you aren't going to be able to guess, but uh, do your best. I'm going to show you for a little while, then give you the answer. So keep score what you could guess. Uh, leave in the comments which ones uh, you did own and couldn't guess, or which ones you never owned and had no chance of guessing. See how all the scores kind of settle out there of, did you maybe possibly own all these and were able to guess them all? That'd be pretty amazing. So let's start just a little quiz. Start out with a fairly easy one. That is this. What? What figure came with this accessory? What do you think? I'm trying to give you every possible angle I can. Alrighty, time is up. This is a broken baseball bat, not a cricket bat, from sort of the original Ninja Turtles line, the 1989. Of course goes to Casey Jones. Casey Jones had his uh, different weapons like golf clubs and all that and broken baseball bats. Go to the next one. We have this. Huh, what could this have gone to? Do you recognize it? I'd weigh in on what I thought it looked like but I, I don't know. I don't want to give you any hints that you don't want. Kinda looks like a harpoon. Oh, whoops, I said something. I can tell you probably think you know it. Alrighty. This is from the Deep Dive Batman. 1991. From uh, the Batman Returns movie. Uh, the toys were, were coming out around that time. That was a really cool Batman. I like that with the underwater and I could take it into water and play with that so this is a cool one to have. Alrighty, we'll go to the next one. What the heck is this thing? What figure could this have went to? Whoa. Can you guess it? Did you get it? Did you give up? This is an accessory from 1996, Spider-Man, the animated series, from the Hydro-Man figure. You could hold this hook up and it could squirt water. Pretty cool features on that figure. Alrighty, how about this? Huh? This came with a figure? Not a playset or something? Nope, well, this is a figure's accessory. What figure? I don't know. That's your job to guess it. Kinda looks like a brick wall, wouldn't you say? Was this from the Tetris action figure? No. <laughs> what do you think? You guess it? It's kind of a know it or you don't situation. This is uh, one half of the little brick wall that came with like the first Buzz Lightyear figure from 1996 from the release of Toy Story. It was a karate chopping figure. So you can set up a little brick wall and you chop it and break it in half. You ever have that buzz? Alrighty, next piece. Small one. What could this have gone to? Obviously there's some wear and tear. Shininess has rubbed off over time. What could that go to? This piece is from a figure from the animated series, Iron Man, is the space armor. This is just a shoulder piece. He had all these pieces that went onto the Iron Man. Gave this shiny extra armor. This is just one little piece. Hard to guess, was it? Was it easy? Let me know. Alrighty, next piece. What in the world is this thing? Which way does it even go? You know? Hmm. What the heck is it? 
This piece is from around 95-96 when they switched the Power Rangers from the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers into the Zeo Power Rangers. This is just a weapon that uh, every ranger had. They usually had special weapons individualized, but they always had some common weapons like this. This is just one that every, uh, every ranger had. Next piece here. Ooh. Looks dangerous. Let's see what the comments say about it. What is this puppy from? This little slicey piece here is from the Hover Attack Batman from the Batman and Robin movie, 1997. Had these little slices and he had a glider he kind of was supposed to fly on, I guess. Guess he was just gonna slice up some people. Slice! Ooh, here's a. This could be a tricky one here. What do you think? Somebody's item here. What figure could it be from? Kinda got a design in there and the handle. Or if this is a handle, I don't know which way it goes. I don't know nothing about it. <laughs> Alrighty. This is actually from the Masked Rider action figure in 1995 when they tried to start up another show using Japanese footage from the Saban Entertainment. It's Masked Rider's sword. Did you know Masked Rider? Probably not. I don't know. He wasn't that popular. Alrighty. Here's another piece. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, made in Malaysia. Well, that's interesting. You don't see that too much. What the heck could this have been from? Oh, nobody knows. Or do you? Do you know? You probably have seen this before. This is an armor chest piece, of course, from The New Adventures of He-Man. The new cartoon in 1989, trying to bring it back to life. Unfortunately, I was late to the He-Man bandwagon, so the only toys that were ever available were from this show, even though I could never even see the cartoon, because I think it was exclusive on, like, the Disney Channel or some channel we couldn't get, so. But I did have the toys, because that was the only He-Mans I could really get a hold of, were these kind of Space Age, Star Wars ripoff style He-Man cartoon. <laughs> Look at spacey armor there. Alright, this one might be difficult. I don't know if you can get it. I kind of doubt it. Think you can get this one? Who's freaking... I mean, what is this? Maybe it's a gun? Maybe it's... Who knows? It's up to you to decide. One too hard? Might be struggling with this one. This one is from VR Troopers. This is Dark Hearts. One of his assault cannon weapons. I always thought he looked like a cool character, so. And that VR Troopers, they had really cool designs and really liked that show, and the toys were really cool. This is a cool gun from one of the guys on there Blackheart. That's a good one to look up the secret of about that character if you're not familiar with the show. Alright, that's the 10. Better write up your score. Write which ones you had no chance of ever guessing or which ones stumped you even though you had it at the time. Uh, we'll do a little bonus round. This is the round where I have no answer. You're just going to have to lay down the guess of what the bonus item is. you got to identify it amongst yourselves down in the comments. See what the heck it is. So... Here is an interestingly shaped item. And there is a printed hint on there. That should help figure out what the deal is with this. But what is this thing? I can't tell you the answer. You're going to have to tell me in the comments below. So let me know the score of your quiz and can you guess the super bonus item to really clean up? I'm going to have to trust that you uh, answer uh, truthfully there. Nobody's going to be impressed if you somehow cheated on all these, so it'd be pretty hard to do. Well, let me know if you like these quizzes. If you want more, give it a like if you liked it, and do hit subscribe for any chance of seeing a few more quizzes. So I'll see you next time.